Hey, what's up everybody? RPM with you here. Daytradingradio.com, rpmtech.tv, doing a little tech segment here for you. Um, there's a product called, or a company called Mark of the Unicorn. Uh, the short uh, for that is Motu. And I'm going to showcase one of their mixer products, uh, audio um, uh, mixer products, breakout boxes. It's a physical uh, box, as all of their hardware is, designed for uh, the home and professional studio um, for plugging in um you know external analog sources digital sources uh, xlr 40 uh, uh 40 volt um phantom power uh, microphones and things of that nature and uh basically uh what i'm focusing on right now is a little unit that has enabled me to broadcast a show on day trading radio um remotely from a uh, remote vacation uh location and if I've, I've got uh about four computers with me and I brought with me specifically laptops and this USB uh, mixer box that's allowed me to plug my microphone directly, uh, my headset microphone directly into this box. Anyway, the product specifically uh, that I'm talking about is the Microbook 2. Microbook 2 by Mark of the Unicorn of Motu. And this specific software you see on the screen right now is called the QMix FX. And there's a different version of this that comes with uh, all of their different products. So each one is tailored for the specific USB-based products. Or you may have a PCI uh, uh, card that's in your computer and one of their older uh, units. Uh, but this one is the Microbook 2. So with our broadcast at Day Training Radio, we like to uh, include different elements in our broadcast. Not only a microphone signal, but... Um, also, a pit background feed, which is uh, technically uh, a bunch of individuals and the ambient sound and noise that's associated with the, the Futures pit uh, in Chicago. So we mix that in. Now, I'm going to turn that on in just a second and let you hear it. All right, and there it is. Now let me show you a way that you can modify that input with the use of EQ and dynamics. Um, specifically EQ, I'm going to actually use a, uh, a little boost here in the mids. And I'm going to turn this off and on and let you hear the difference. Hear all that noise, high pitch hiss, and some rumble. So I'm using QMix FX, I'm using the EQ to fix that. It's that simple. It makes the broadcast so much cleaner without that hiss. The only way to do that is to bring that source in from another computer. You can't mix that directly on the encoding computer itself. So anyway, there's your uh, your tip there We're using the Mark of the Unicorn product called QMix FX. This has been a rpmtech.tv production. You can see uh, daytradingradio.com. You can see me on Fridays doing the shows. And also the RPM Tech Talk Live. RPM Tech Talk Live on Tuesday evenings at daytradingradio.com. We'll be bringing those back up probably in September. Take care, everyone. RPM out.